Hi everyone. I want to make this video for youth and adolescents who are really struggling with life. I don't have all the answers for you, but what I wanted to do was share from my heart that there is hope for life. I'd like to back up a little bit to my own life. I used a wheelchair to walk. When I was an infant, I had a rare hip disease. And the medical knowledge back in the late 1970s and early 1980s just isn't what it is available today and some well-meaning doctors they meant well but they wrecked my right hip and damaged my right knee in the process of trying to help me so it really brings me to a choice as an adult am I going to be bitter about it or am I going to make the decision to try to work with what I have and make the best of a very, very difficult situation. You know, and my choice is the second, to make the best of the very difficult situation that I found myself in. So there's a number of doctors and other people in the healthcare field that have come on alongside of me and after seeing my mo motivation for life are trying their best to help me. Part of this is a commitment from me to undergo an hour of physiotherapy five days a week. You know, it's pretty near marathon level training with just how the effort it takes and how exhausting it is for me in fact, that's why my hair is wet right now. I've just come back from doing the pool. And I was really thinking about youth who struggle while I was in the water tonight, and that's why I wanted to make this video. What I wanted to share with you is if you're willing, I'm, I'm positive there's an adult or some type of leader in your community who would take an interest in your life and come alongside of you the same as the doctors have done for me if you're willing to work hard at working through your issues. And I probably get it that it's hard to trust again once you've been hurt and repeatedly hurt. So I know asking you to try to trust an adult may not be the easiest thing to do. But if it is, and if you're able to, there's a really, really rewarding life to be had once you've worked through your challenges. You know, when you've been hurt, the people who hurt you go on with their lives. And the hurt they leave behind is like letting them live rent free in your mind and in your emotions and helping ruin the joy that you could be having in life. So I wanted to challenge you both to try to own what you're doing and try to look for a more positive future in your life. I also just wanted to let you know that there's someone out there that actually does care regardless of how hard today has been for you. I know it takes a lot to pull it together. I know it's not easy going through puberty when the hormones are just raging through your body and where a good night's sleep makes all the difference in the world and how you're going to act and react to situations. But there are good people around in this world that really do care. 
and your life is worth something. And after you've worked through your challenges, you're able to be a role model for the next person you come across who's really struggling in life. This isn't a one minute job to get your life sorted, but it's having the motivation to persevere, you know, to work on anger or trust issues, and to know that you're worth it, and regardless of what effort it takes to sort through these issues, that there will be a decent life for you. And it's going to be all the more rewarding because the effort that you took and the effort that you made to address the situations in your life that are holding you back. Some of the people you could talk to would be a sports leader, could be your favorite teacher at school, could be a guidance counselor from school, could be another community leader, and does take time for a relationship to form. But if you're needing the help, I want to challenge you to step out and take the first step by asking an adult for the support that you need. I'm not asking you to do nothing I haven't in my own life. You know, I'm frequently in medical appointments where I'm put in the position where I have to ask for help. But there's a trust that forms and it's formed with me and my doctors that I think you'll have the same thing happen in your life. I just want you to know that your life matters and that there's something unique that only you are going to be able to bring to the people where you live. And that there's a really special life to be had the more that you work at your issues and the more that you per persevere a situation that's challenging. I hope you'll find some of these words encouraging. Thank you for the time you spent with me today. Bye for now.